Operators of the Uniben shuttle buses have stopped working since last Wednesday when their Doe state government increased their tax from 50 naira to 600 naira daily. The situation has led the student union government of the University of Benin to pitch tent with the drivers. The SUG president, Osemudiame Ogidi, Assistant Secretary General, Momodu Ehizua, and the Director of Welfare, Agedo Gifted, said the new tax policy by the state's government is not in the best interest of the students as the drivers will be forced to increase their fare. They said they were hoping the government will subsidize the cost of transportation fare, not the other way around. The comrade bus is even more costlier than the shuttle bus. These persons are our fathers and we should respect their magnanimity for whatever they are doing for us and not to incur more problems for them. Stop making education difficult for the poor masses. We want to prosper in this country. Enough is enough. The hardship is too much. There is no reason of whatsoever why the government will want to overtax the poor to keep the rich in their comfort life. So we are saying to the Edo State government to look into the eyes of the poor. If the levies or the driver is how much, you discover that directly or indirectly is going to affect the student. And of which the welfare, 100% well-being of the student is a priority. So I want to appeal to the state government to do what is necessary so that the student will not suffer the brunt. Some of the drivers and passengers noted that only the Unibet shuttle buses accept 50 naira per passenger against the 150 naira and above that other commercial buses charge. We are begging the government to please allow these people to work. Let them work to 200 naira from every spot. Make it 600 naira a day plus 150 they pay for this land. How much did they work in one day? For the past five years, I was able to pay 15 naira going and 15 naira coming, and a total of 700 naira a week if you want to go from here to Ugbo, which is the cheapest transport fare you can afford. So I'm begging on the state government to please, please come to our aid. Commenting on the issue in a telephone interview, the Commissioner for Infrastructure in Edo State, architect Amioleme Abraham, said the issue will be looked into. It will be resolved, that issue will be resolved so that they don't uh, pay too much. But what I'm aware of is that those that come to Ring Road, they pay 200 naira to the local government. That is what I do. And when they get to, when they get to Selu, they pay another 200 because that is under a local government. And they, that will be resolved. I'm sure if, if they make representation, the deputy governor spoke on it. If they make representation, that will be resolved. I'm very sure of that. The university students and drivers are hoping that the issue will be addressed soon. Best Mbire reporting.